When I first started working here at Aikens Ford in Winder, Georgia, right through here was a in and out. There was no roundabout here. It was essentially just a way in and a way out with custom trucks down the center and down either side. A beautiful entrance, but for Mr. Brad Aikens, it's got to be next level legit, y'all. So I am so thankful for Mr. Brad Aikens, first and foremost, and all the great people that work here and associate with the dealership and why with his accessory store, but so much so that we get unbelievable entrances like our Aikens Mountain right here, which is truly incredible. And you know, I just got my swagger back. If you didn't see that video, you gotta see it. It's very epic. And I've got my Super Duty right over there on 42s, and it is truly legit, like super legit, but, I get brought back down to earth when our unique customs of this variation that we had great confidence in did not find its way out of here yet. And it breaks my heart because we build something with all of our heart knowing that it's a mint, next level, real deal, why with these diamond, and it just, it's still here. So I just need help again. And the SUVs have been, have been, on, have been on my bad list because they used to be legit too. They used to be boom, 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 let's go. And now they're not. They're just, they're, for some reason, is the SUV market uh, being stale right now? Obviously, because we got a banger right here and it's still sitting. So I want to know the Ford screen, what did we do wrong? Is it the bronze wheel? I mean, price point, we're still in a great setup right there. We're 59.9 and it's discounted on top of that. We have lowering kit, we got Falcons, niche wheels custom paint galore on the forge green i mean in the stock form it's it's a good looking color but in this variation it is a diamond in that forge green a lot of flake in there you see it custom tails this applique i call it piece explore inlay emblem i mean it is all there sitting just right just right y'all and i know you're saying maybe look at the st pricing and being comparable pick the ST over this. I get that. I understand. But where this thing is discounted currently with the amenities that it has with leather on the inside, ample power, and just a unique variation you won't see. I mean, I'm thinking we got to take those wheels off and go to a black wheel. I'd put the same one on there in black. I hate to maybe have to do it, but I think that might be what is the next step because it's a diamond, y'all. It, it, is, it is standing perfect stance-wise, width, and all amenities etc even a great discount right now but for some reason just stalemate so that one's hurting me we have had real success with our super duties and bringing back the f-150 covert and of course you know about that i mean i'm just standing around a 37 package like it's nothing but that's a stellar vehicle right there so we have great lineup we have these rocky mountain trucks in ram and f-150 available too but I got to run right over here. Stay with me. Come right over here. We've got another one in Iconic Silver. Another no doubt banger. We actually took ST wheels uh, off of one of our ST customer builds. And we're able to put the ST wheels on here. But another Iconic Silver clean and classy variation Still here, I don't know. And this one was even before the forest green. But to me, a diamond, yeah, I guess if I'm just sitting here being honest, probably should have had an aftermarket with the entire combo because you know when it was in the showroom, people thought, I guess it was the ST or people thought that you know it, it looked custom but had factory wheels, so it kind of threw them off a little bit. But the 21 inch ST wheel is a rare unique piece. And this one's even cheaper, slightly. Uh, and discounted very heavily as well. So these are two SUVs from Ford that we've customized and enhanced and made next level, but still here for some reason. I guess, I mean, it always falls on me <laughs> because it's my fault because if, if, I'm, if I'm speaking and, and believing and, and knowing that I got the evidence that I'm gonna outwork it, anybody in this industry to outpromote, outwork, uh, outgrind, but these vehicles are still not selling. It's my fault. It's my fault, y'all. So here I am again trying to show you once more these two in hopes that uh, someone out there is looking for this vehicle because they are special. They are both a very unique and special. 
uh, and price accordingly now. Now, off that tangent, another stellar covert F-150 on 22 inch American forces, leveled on 35s, rolling lock bed cover and more. I mean, if if you see these two explorers, you're like, okay, you're nothing special, they're real deal. But that they are, but it's all we do is every day. We got so many great things going on on the daily, like Corey White's F-150, Platinum Covert. Just there's so much special vehicles hanging around here, and most of them are for sale, y'all. So hit your boy up. Hit, hit us up at the dealership. We'll make it happen. If you want us to tweak a few things on one of these Explorers, we'll definitely do that too. But we got to get them gone. We got to, y'all, because it hurts my heart. I just got my swagger back on my 350 Custom. But, you know, it, it just hurts seeing these here because they've just been here for too long. And they're, they're a diamond. They're, they're a can't-miss diamond. So probably going to change wheels on both of these uh, to help. Uh, but in the meantime... Hit us up, y'all, and stay tuned for more. Hit that subscribe button because we're bringing you just check out my videos. This today just kind of a rant slash trying to put some more attention on these on these two right here. But if you're following along and you're watching this in this early February 2023, I'm just telling you right now, we have some F450 Western Reserves and some Indo Editions. I'm telling you, that's going to shake things up even more. Next level. Wild Willies, Aikens, next level. Peace out.